with David Washington waiting on deck. Washington also homered in the game last night. Goldeyes homered four times in total, a season high. Righty against righty. Sims off the third base side of the rubber. Payoff pitch. Line shot down the left field line. The drops in fear for a base hit, and the Gold Eyes will take the lead. Sagal around third hole scores. The ball bounces into the corner. Murphy on his way to second, and he gets there standing up with a two-out RBI double, and the Gold Eyes have a 1-0 lead in the top half of the first inning. 2-2 pitch, breaking ball lifted high in the air to left center field, pretty deep. Narrier racing back to the warning track, still going back. Narrier leaps, and Narrier can't get it. It's over the fence for a three-run homer, and the Gold Eyes lead it 4-0 in the top half of the third. David Washington with his 10th home run of the year, an opposite field towering shot just to the left of the 405 marker. Narrier raced back, hung up on the fence, but came up empty trying to pull it back. And the Gold Knights had another big home run. 4-0 Winnipeg here in the top half of the third. 2-2 pitch, line drive out to left field. It's going to fall in front of Rivera for a base hit. Taylor around third, racing for home. The throw is cut off by Sagal. Taylor slides in safe. It's a two-out RBI single to left for Zach Nerrier. And the railroaders are on the board. It's 4-1 Winnipeg here in the third inning. 2-2 pitch, ground ball right side, tough play. It's through the shift, a base hit to right field. In to score, Sagal Murphy on his way to third. The throw is not in time. David Washington rips an RBI single through the right center field. And the Gold Eyes re-extend the lead to 5-1 in the top half of the fourth. The 2-1 pitch. High fly ball to center, pretty deep. Back goes Rivera to the winning track at the wall. Reaching back, he makes the catch up against the wall. Clemens tags will go to third, but a huge catch there by Eric Rivera. Wolf hit that a ton. And the pitch, ground ball towards the middle, tough play, Lachance picks it up, goes to second for one, the to first, and it's in time for the double play, and the inning is over. And 1998, 1-2, breaking ball, lifted high in the air to left, it's pretty deep, back goes Wolf to the warning track, back to the wall, leaping, and it's gone! Max Murphy homers for his second consecutive night. A three-run shot just to the right of the scoreboard in left center field. And the Gold Eyes open up an 8-1 lead in the top half of the sixth inning. So behind in the count, 1-2, and two, Murphy hits one high and deep in the year to left center. His 10th home run this season. Here's the 1-0 pitch. Line drive towards the hole, base it through to left field. Simpson scores from third. Hill Alexander with a two-out RBI single to left. And the Gold Eyes lead a slice to 8-2. to two. The L one pitch. Line drive towards left field. That's going to get down for a base hit. Rick Forney is waving David Washington to the plate. Here's a throw by Hunter Wolf. Simpson cuts it off. Washington slides in safe without a relay. Deion Stafford Jr. with an RBI single to left. And the goal eyes stretch the lead to 9-2 in the top half of the eighth inning. Hernandez goes. 3-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. He struck him out in a slider. And the ball game is over. Tasker Strobel fans, Matt Morgan, and Al Real, the Winnipeg Gold Eyes, can celebrate a series victory. They take the rubber match of this series from the Cleburne Railroaders, 9-2 at the depot at Cleburne Station.